Well, take care. I'm going to head back to Roland now. That said, I'm still a little worried about you two. Are you sure you want you don't want me to come along? Yes, I do. Don't take a fucking party member away from me, you fucks. We'll be fine. No, you won't. All the reason we're going on this trip is become is to become senior bracers. You wouldn't be training anymore if you came with us. At least give me back my fucking orbs if you were leaving. And if you didn't go back, the Roland branch would have a hard time managing things. Don't worry about us. We'll figure out a way to get things done. Well, if you insist. It's pretty rare for someone your age to be aiming for senior bracer status, so don't overdo it. And if you run into trouble, contact the Roland branch, you got it? I'll come running no matter where you are. Well, sure, you'll come running, but it'll take the time it takes if you're gonna run. Sure, thanks, Chera. The same goes for you. Don't get yourself too liquored up. That's the only thing I'm worried about. All right, all right. I'll watch the number of drinks. Ha, never fear, dear children. You can count on me to protect fair Shara. Weren't you going to go with them? And why are you headed to Roland? Not to mention with Shara. That's because I've tasted all there is to taste of the local dish dishes here in Bose. And I thought it was about time I turned my attentions towards another region. As for Roland's cuisine, I've heard the pr produce is just to die for. And that's what I'm looking forward to next. That's pretty much it. It says he wants me to introduce him to a nice restaurant and, ha and some lovely vegetables or some such nonsense. As he's so persistent, I only agreed to him coming along under the condition that he go drinking with me at the bar. We'll never see him alive ever again. Olivier, I really hope you understand what you've promised her. I could die for the likes of fine women and food. Part of me longs to be with by your side as you continue your journey, Joshua. But after many agonizing hours of consideration, I've decided to accompany Fair Sherazard instead. I think I'll be better off with you a safe distance away from me. I'll have fun, but I'm warning you. Don't you dare make any trouble in Roland, you hear me? And here's another piece of advice. When Shara's sure at the bar, watch out. That's when the gloves come off. I'm seriously not joking when I say you should beware. How dare you speak about your mentor like that, Estelle? And besides, Ina's coming along too. Yeah, she's even worse than you. Gloves comes off, huh? Is that perchance what you and Estelle were talking about before? Yes, Estelle said it best though. It was nice knowing you. Yes, it was a pleasure. Eh? Huh? Well, Ollie boy- oh, don't call him that, please. <laughs> well, Ollie boy, it looks like it's our time- it's time for us to leave. Come on now, we better hurry to get- and get on. Chara, wait! Can we talk about this? I'd really appreciate it if I had just a little more time to think th things through. Surely you're not getting cold feet already. If you consider yourself a man, then quit acting like a ninny. See you later, Shara. Give us re give our regards to everyone in Roland. Have a wonderful trip, you two. Please do this. Me, it's moving slightly too slow for me. Chapter one end. Cool. We'll clear the chapter. Do I, okay, save, yes. Bam. That's about the gist of the Skybound incident that occurred in Northern Liberal. I think that the bankrupt Kwakwa family drifted all the way over down there. You might be contacted by Liberal regarding the incident, so deal with it as you see fit. Yeah, it turns out I wasn't able to meet him in the end. It seems like something else must have come up. Also, the connection with the Sky Bandit incident is still unknown, but it's clear that another power is to work here. No, it's not like that at all. I've also become acquainted with an interesting bunch. The food's great, and there are babes everywhere. This is unquestionably my kind of country. Maybe I'll just take up permanent residence here while I'm at it. Alright, alright. There's no need to throw a fit. Anyway, 
See what else you can find out. Just don't get caught looking into things by the chance. Is that, stupid? Is that Chancellor? All right. I'll contact you again, my dear friend. Maybe I've not ha seen the spelling of Chancellor that much, or it looked like it was spelled wrong. Oh, I love messing with that guy. It's just so stuffy and uptight, like I can't help myself. Portable phone, huh? Well, aren't you carrying around quite the nifty gadgets? Sure. In fact, you're carrying around an ornament that even the size central factory couldn't create. Well, how about you tell me who you really are? Come on, Shara, don't treat me like I'm some kind of stranger. I'm Olivier Lenheim, the wandering bard and gifted musician you've come to adore. But if you'd like to know... Get, if you'd like to get to know me better, I'm sure we could arrange something. A little pillow talk, perhaps. How about we skip the foreplay and go straight to the, to the climax? You cheap antics don't fool me, Olivier. Should I call you Mr. Erebonian Operative? <laughs> it looks like the title Civil Streak isn't just for show. I guess you were pretending that you didn't notice in front of Estelle and Joshua. Huh? I don't want to worry those two any more than they already have, or already are. So back to the subject at hand. Why don't you start talking? Who are you and what are you doing in Liberal? For that, I'm going to have to correct you on two points. First off, these cheap antics, or as you call them, uh, as you call them, are totally natural. I'm not play acting or anything. That's just who I am. Oh, I'm sure. So do you mean to tell me that you drank that wine without paying just... Without paying just because you felt like it? And after that, being taken to the Hawken gate just so you could gather information was all part of the plan? And you even set yourself up to run into us? I don't think so. I'll leave that part up to your imagination. That, that was a weird pronunciation of that. Imagination! The other thing I must correct you on is that this device is not an ornament. It's an artifact which was unearthed in the Empire. It can piggyback off any orbital communication systems, and its transmissions can be encrypted, so there's no no worry about them being intercepted. It comes in handy for a busy man such as myself. Artifact, like one of the sacred relics the Septian Church has stewardship over. Now I'm all more curious to know what you're after. Oh no no no, Shara. You should never try to pry into the secrets of a mysterious beauty all at once. How would you like to know? How would you like to get to know a, a real woman? I'd be more than willing to show you, to show you with my whip. Sure, I don't see any humor in those eyes. Well, jokes aside, you really should have just been straightforward from the beginning. As you have already figured out, my position is that of an operative in the Empire. But I have no intention of sabotaging anything or stealing classified information. I merely came here to meet a certain someone. A certain someone? Yes, someone you know all too well. The one lauded as the supreme swordsman and master strategist by the royal army. The bracer with a special title belonging to but four people throughout the whole of the entire continent. The divine blade cast his bright is the one I seek. Mad Madrigal of the White Magnolia. Let's see, if we're going to travel around the entire kingdom, then our next destination is the Ruan region. I wonder which ru route we should take to get there. Probably to the left? About that. So you're really not planning on using the airliner? I think it's going to be quite the detour if we head there on foot. Remember what Shara said, right? We need to walk and actually see the places we protect first. Or is it Dad who said that? Well, I guess since we have some time on our hands, it shouldn't... Wouldn't it be too wouldn't it be a bad thing to head there on foot. We could we could save the money. We could save the money. It's oh my god. We could save the money. It would cost to use an airliner. Okay, great idea. We could use the money to. We can use the money we save to go shopping at the boss market. After all, we didn't have the time to spend shopping around leisurely during the whole sky bandit mess. And then we could leave after that. So what do you think? I don't care either way, but try not to waste too much money. Just so you know, in order to enter the Ruan region, we'll need to go through the Crone Pass to the west. 
I'm already aware we escorted a person there. Once we're done shopping, let's leave through the west gate. Okay, the west gate, right? Also, why the fuck would we go shopping? We don't have anything. Also, thank you, you gave all my things back. It's mighty kind of you. I don't believe there's much you could give me. Um. Well, no, I could take away... Okay, hold on. Shit, hold on. No. Balls, I could... Oh, it's just different. It's petrifier or poison. It's the same thing, but... Right, I could do that. That gives... Ooh, that gives me Thalas. I don't know what that is. Earth Guard, Stone Hammer, Petrified Stone Impact. Cool. Uh, that would be neat. Let's do that. And then... Prevent enemy arts. Agility. Do we want that? That makes... That means that we won't have... Uh, fire but that gives us an amount of things what does Thales do apparently it does something here revives and heals 100 Ooh, I see wait how the fuck that gives how does oh that's that's earth okay it wasn't there that's not golden okay I was like what how the fuck but no no Oh, wait. It means that we lose diamond dust, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Now we do gain stone impact instead, but we don't get a offensive water one. If we shift it like that. That is unfortunate. Uh, if we shift this around anymore, well, if we... If we don't have the gold, those two gold or yellow ones, we won't together with this, we won't be able to get stone impacts uh, we won't have the revive but if we if we shift petrify there instead that's yeah, so if we do... If we do that... Oh no, that doesn't... No, that. There we go. That does give us diamond dust. And then if we do petrify... Yeah, it works. Okay, this works. This was better, yeah. We don't get Thalos, but I don't need that, I think. So that's fine. We get a bunch of stuff. You, we stick with that because those are really good things. I would like to open up these uh, or yeah, this one. That could give us some more options. Um, yeah, death blow is not good because that's going to disappear. Blind I already have and cast one I already have. So I can't do that. EP cut I already have. Eagle eye would be a thing I guess to get or to put on. Uh, other than that... Uh, Fuck do I know? Uh, would be probably attack to get fire. Um, other than that, who knows? I don't think I had anything. Well, it would be like hit, hit or eagle eye. But would there be anything I could do with more yellow and gray? I don't think I can get anything that works with that yeah I need more time to get white Gehenna if anything um yeah no um, no hold on Wait. how much is this one two five yeah I need eight in order to do any more Yeah, no, I can't do anything else other than that. So that would be everything uh, that I could do with that anyways. Uh, 
Uh, how much money do we have? Twelve. Um, did we even find the... Yes, we did find the ring. Um... Do we leave it to her, I guess? Yeah. We did find that ring. Where the fuck did they live? Is it you? Yes, there we go. Yes, that's right. Just something I can help you with. Actually, we found a ring that looks something like the one you mentioned in the job request of the guild. If we could, we'd like to have a have you take a look at it. Really? Truly? Oh. Who would have ever thought this would have come back to me like this? There is no doubt that this is the ring that was stolen. No, this is the one that was stolen, alright? It was a memento from my mother. I would know I would know it anywhere. I see. It must be really important to you then, right? I'd almost believe that I would never see it again. I don't know how I can ever repay you for finding this. I'm just glad we could help. So I guess our work here is done, unless there's something else. No, that's all. But once again, thank you for finding this for me. And then if that's all, we'll be leaving you to your business. Have a nice day. Cool. There we go, and then we need to head back to get our payment for that. Uh, it's the right one, right? Yes, it is. Oops. No! Let's report. Brilliant. Um, 2000 and game BP. Still sixth class. There's no more quests here, right? No. There were three that had to deal with monsters, but these fucking monsters never appeared. So, pff, fucking, that's not something I can do about. So, what am I supposed to do about enemies that don't actually appear? I guess it would be here, unless they've restocked somehow. I uh, doubt it. And there would be something else here. Hello, you got something? Oh, wait a minute, slots, yeah. You had everything there. Boom! Fuck yeah, let's go. Okay, you don't have anything else, right? Yes, blind move. No. Not super interested. I could, but no. Great! That's everything there. Okay, and then we head to Orbment, and let's see. What can we equip you with? If we scroll and see if there's anything here. Nope, nothing particularly. So let's see. Hits is extra hit chance, I guess. The enemies ahead of time. Prevent enemies from art succeeding. 50% of chance. Do, do, do. More defense. More agility, attack. I guess it would be attack. You know, so we have fire at least. Because then we have every element of attack between the two of us. So that's good. Because yeah, we got stone hammer, airstrike, aqua bleed, amongst other stronger ones. She also has soul blur. <clears throat> then he has fire bolt, and he has stronger ones of those. And that would be all the main four. Yeah, and then. Yeah, cool. Amongst other cool things. Good, good. So outside of that, uh, we got you. Weapons and such. I don't care for you to talk shop. Okay. We had everything that was the best things, I believe. I'm pretty sure we bought that. Prevent seal, prevent sleep, prevent freeze. Red poison prevent blind. Yeah, we have that. Okay, good. So now we want to head back in here. Okay, talk with random people. See what the fuck they have. Red scarf plus two defense. I will. I guess we can buy two for now. Because we can probably put that on them. So this prevents poison. Makes it become earth based. You know what? We're just not going to have you have that. Prevent poison. Seems neat. Prevent freeze. Prevent sleep. Prevent blind. Um, now you know what? Keep the poison one. Prevents poison. Pre oh, prevents seal. Prevents poison. Sure, you do the same. Defense prevents 
poison and extra defense now. Good. Oh god. Shop what you got. Have I... Do I have these? Sweet sponge cake and floral jelly. Floral jelly... Yep. I have already... Oh, wait a minute. It would say at the, at the side then, yeah. If I had the recipe or not. I have these things. I don't know if they do jack shit. Oh, no. You're not pressure running anything. Neither are you. You have something, surely. Work helmet. Essential piece of headgear for laborers. Ah. Uh, three defense. Do we want that? Ah, uh, we'll leave it. Okay. What about you? Okay, we got some money, so... Yeah, let's buy five of these. Actually, while we're at it... thousand there so we can take that some of those yeah that's fine ten of these uh, let's buy five more that's a thousand okay let's leave it at that what do you have you have uh, ingredients I would imagine yes you do some of them are quite expensive and that's fine let's buy Bunch of those, bunch of those. Do I buy ten of these? I mean, I could actually. Mm, well, no. Let's keep. We we might need a good amount of money for you know when we um, get to. Uh, the other continents, and also you had these super expensive things. We need at least one to make boiled miso carp. Let's buy two. This, let's buy two as well. We'll get some money on our way. Everything else is fine. To keep as is. Then it's you, is it? No? What do you have? Also some stuff. Yeah, we have plenty of these things. Good, okay. That should be everything here. Um, yeah, except in church, there's the. Here is something. Uh, the bar. Uh, she's risotto. I guess. They'll restore something at least. Okay, so. I... That would also give me the recipe, but I'm already got it oh yeah there it's good okay or at least they recovered HP and that is lodgings but that's fine so it would be the West Post uh, highway this bit Wonderful. Uh, I guess we'll save here, though. Cool, cool. I feel like that's a good place to stop uh, now. So we've entered Chapter 2. So next time, we will be heading towards the Ruin continent or country or whatever. Uh, the border, anyways, to Ruin, to the west and uh continue our journey as bracers so thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed it and i hope to see you in the next episode